Hey, everybody. So it's been a while since I've done one of these, and I apologize. I do still have a college shirt on. It is Friday afternoon. It's almost five o'clock. Um, and I'm sitting on the stairs on purpose because I checked the list from Cousin Chief Tim. And um, I did want to check. You can have the clock ringing now. It is five o'clock. I checked the list and it said how to vacuum the stairs. It's one of the skills that you should know. So obviously, if I turn the vacuum on, you won't be able to hear me, but I'm going to get the vacuum out and at least demo the concept of how you would do it. And then hopefully, if you have stairs at your house, um, you can help the family out and do some vacuuming of the stairs. Let's take a look. Okay, so we have an upright, um, but the concept is the same even if you have uh, the two part, you know, with the, my mom called it the puppy dog behind, and then you would drag it around. Uh, if you have a Roomba, obviously Roombas don't do stairs. Um, they really don't like stairs. So basic concept, we could actually take uh, the vacuum, um, and there's a little switch here, kind of step on that, that lets you lean this back, and then you would just vacuum the stairs, in much the same way, I would actually keep that clicked in place, vacuum the stairs in much the same way that you vacuum the floor, okay? Now that way is kind of a pain in the neck or pain in the shoulder in reality because vacuum cleaners can be kind of heavy. So the better option, we're gonna pull this tab off of here. And we got this hose thing like this. And then with my vacuum cleaner, we actually have this stair attachment. Some of them don't have it that look like that. They just have it that looks like this broad, I uh, just kind of a broad section like this, kind of triangle shaped. So you would put that onto this hose. I'm gonna put our stair tool on. Sorry for the weird angle on the phone. Put our stair tool on, and then you would turn the vacuum cleaner on and just Cross, just kind of pulling back, vacuuming like this. Maybe do a cross like this. And if it's real bad in here, you're going to use what's called the crevice tool. That's the one that looks like this, super narrow. This is also good for getting inside the couch cushions. So if you're going to be vacuuming the stairs, maybe consider vacuuming inside the couch cushions as well. Mom and dad, grandma, grandpa, uncle, aunt, whoever you may have uh, coming over or living with you. We'll appreciate that you did that work. So that's it. That's how you vacuum the stairs. Uh, kind of the crash course on that. Uh, you guys who have me in class, you're familiar. I started doing crash course things anyhow. So that is this week's College Friday um, Life Skill Funky Friday. Sorry, I forgot my hashtags. College Friday Funky Friday Life Skill. I hope you learned a little something. Uh, if you don't have stairs now, then hopefully it's a skill you can use later. Best of luck with it. Don't get hurt vacuuming the stairs. Enjoy your weekend. Take care of yourself, one another. Stay safe. Wash your hands. Wear a mask for my household of yours. We love you.